folks, welcome to Sherwood Park, Toledo, located at 31 Audubon Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this 2020 Toyota Sienna SC all-wheel drive. Now the most suitable features on this SC all-wheel drive is its power moonroof. if you have your heated front seats and navigation system. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this 2020 Toyota Sienna SC all-wheel drive. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this Sienna SE is its daytime running lights. You also have fog lights as well. And taking a look just over on the side, you have the 18 inch aluminum alloy wheels, foldable mirrors as well as your heated mirrors. And then if you take a look on the inside of the mirror, you're gonna find your blind pulmonary indicator. Now with that indicator, it'll actually light up just learning you if there is another vehicle right beside you. Smart key system with it. And then if you take a closer look just at the second row, as you can see, you have the second row captain seats, and then you have the sunshade visors located in the third and second row windows. Now for those long trips, if you want to entertain the, the kids, you have the DVD player just located at the very top here. And you'll find the close button just located on the inside of the pillar here. Now, all you have to do is push on the button once and it will close for you automatically. Now, it does have the jam protection feature, so in the event that the door does sense there's an obstruction in the way, it'll open itself back up automatically. And if you want to close it from the outside, just pull on the handle once more, and it will close for you automatically. The color we're going to be taking a look at today is black, and taking a closer look just at the front dash as well as the front seats, so you do have your black interior. Power driver's seat with lumbar support. Traction control on and off, and then on the inside of the driver's side door, you have your mirror controls, window locks, power locks, and window controls. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your volume control, seat function, mode select, Bluetooth connectivity, voice recognition, lane departure alert, cruise control, and then if we take a closer look just at the multi-informational display, you have a couple of different features on there. The nice thing is that you do have a push button start, so all you have to do is push put on the brake, hit the push button, and it will start up for you automatically. Taking a look at the multi-informational display, as you can see, you do have the digital speedometer with a distance to empty, fuel economy, all-wheel drive, you can also go through and take a look at your compass, audio, lane departure alert, messages, and settings menu, just so you can personalize a couple of the features for yourself. You have an exterior temperature gauge on here as well. And if we take a closer look now, just at the center dash area, as well as the touch panel display, you'll find a couple of options located on here. The nice thing is it does come with the premium JBL sound system with the Sirius XM satellite radio. And then if we go through a couple of the additional features inside here, you'll be able to see, just while that's loading up there, you have your temperature control settings with your hazard lights, dual zone climate control with the rear temperature controls located down below, added to an automatic transmission. Heated seat controls for your driver and passenger with your power outlets located down below. And then if you go inside the menu screen, you're gonna find your destination audio phone as well as a couple of other additional features. With the apps menu, it's part of the Entune app suite, so as long as you have it on your phone, you can use such apps as the Slacker app, which allows you to stream your music from your phone onto the touch panel display. And you can also check on local fuel prices or on the latest sport scores, just depending on what your preferences are. Auto dimming rear view mirror, you'll also find the open and close for the power sliding rear doors, power lift gate, power moonroof, SOS connect, and your sunglass case holder. Taking a look at the backup cameras, you can see you have those nice guiding lines in there making things much easier for you when you're backing into a stall. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate. Now located on the left hand side, you'll find your backup camera and your rear hatch release will be located in the center. Closing in on the rear cargo space, as you can see, you have a 60-40 split for the third row. So in the event that you need one side folded down, you have the option of folding it down, or if you want to fold both sides, you can do so as well. Now, the other nice thing is, just taking a look on the back of the seat, you do have the instructions to actually fold or unfold it. And one of the nice things is, even with one of the sides down, you still have plenty of cargo space located down below. But if you need more, you should have that little bit of extra space located on the left-hand side as well. Over on the right, you'll find that power outlet for yourself. And then when you're all finished up, all you have to do is just push on the back of the tailgate once and it will close for you automatically. Thank you so much, folks, for watching this video today. If you have any questions, please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada.
Phone number is 780-410-2455 or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. Once again, folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day and I hope to see you next time.